Lazy owners need dogs that are easy to maintain. We have compiled a list of top dog breeds for such lazy owners who want to keep dog but don't wish to invest a lot of time in pet maintenance. Low energy dogs are also a good match for those who live in apartments. Most of them tend to be happy, playful, and calmer indoors. They appreciate a good nap as much as a fun game of fetch in the park. Let's take a look at top 30 lazy dog breeds for lazy owners, who will give you all the snuggles you could want. Number 1. Pomeranian Lazy dog breeds, the Pomeranian is the typical lap dog. They are spunky and assertive. The big dog and a small dog mentality is a trait that most Pomeranians express frequently. Certainly one of the laziest dog breeds, and Poms are also loud guard dogs that will certainly let you know if something is approaching. They need minimal exercise, eat very little Pomeranian dog food, and do well in single households because they do not get along with everyone. Number two, Bichon Freeze. Bichon Freeze love to please their owners. They are brilliant and love to show off their skills. Obedience training is a breeze with these pups, but some have a hard time with house training. Bichons will get short bursts of energy followed by a very long nap. This is one of the lazy dog breeds that will require a few short walks during the day. They'll burn their energy while outside and then come in and curl up on the couch with you. Number three, Basset Hound. Lazy dog breeds, the Basset Hound is a lover, plain and simple. One of the most well-known lazy dog breeds, they are wrinkly and stubborn, but well-behaved pets. Because they slobber and tend to make huge puddles from drinking, Basset Hounds aren't the best fit for a tidy home. They love to lounge around and cuddle, but they need to have long walks. Keep them on a leash, though, because they tend to wander off tracking scents. Number four, Boston Terrier. The adorable Boston Terrier is a compact dog that has a happy-go-lucky personality to share with all. These dogs can be energetic, but they are typically pretty well-mannered and serene. They don't spend all of their time napping, but they're happy to relax with you at your request. They tend to be more even keel than most small breeds. Many Boston Terriers enjoy pampering allowing you to dress them up in all sorts of cute clothes. They might be a bit difficult to potty train, but they will come along just fine with persistence. This is the type of dog you can take with you nearly anywhere, as they get along with just about any other creature. Number 5. Pekingese Lazy dog breeds the Pekingese is not fond of exercise at all, and that's what they're known for. Their short bow legs make it difficult for them to run around too much, so they are most comfortable lounging on the laps of their trusty pet owners, who will care and feed the lazy dog. Pekingese are great lap dogs, and trendy dogs among owners who love to carry their pets everywhere. Sadly, they are not very good with children and other dogs or animals, but will get along with cats, according to many pet owners. Number 6. Bulldogs. Bulldogs might be classically one of the laziest breeds known to man. Sure, bulldogs can get up and run around with you for a little bit, but it won't be long until they tuck her out and are snoozing in the corner. Bulldogs are known for their gentle, docile nature. Some of them might not take too kindly to other dogs or smaller animals, but most of the time they are pretty even keeled. Even though a bulldog might appear small, don't let that fool you. These guys are all muscle. Because they are a brachycephalic breed, you have to be extra careful regarding overexertion. It's for the best if these guys don't like romping around too much, because high energy and high heat can make it hard for them to breathe. Number 7. Havanese This is a great city and suburb household pet, and a perfect lazy dog for those looking to spend the least amount of time outdoors. Havanese are good and gentle with children and other animals. They only require slow-paced walks and some playtime for the minimum amount of exercise and mental stimulation. This lazy dog breed was originally bred to be a small companion dog and loves to be pampered and fed their favorite Havanese dog food. Number 8. Chow Chow this breed, best known for its unique blue tongue, originated in China, ironically, as a working dog. Now they can be found lounging on the sofa in the cool indoors rather than running around outside. 
Chow Chows can be independent and stubborn, which might come across as too cat-like for some dog owners. But if your apartment can handle their large size and endless shedding, they do make great couch cuddle buddies. Number 9. Dachshund The Dachshund's short stubby legs are a big reason why they make great lap dogs. They enjoy walks, but a session of indoor ball chasing is enough to provide adequate exercise, and they're most interested in consuming dachshund-friendly foods and napping a lot of the time. Dachshunds make our list of lazy dog breeds, but these pooches are very opinionated and not great family dogs. Originally bred to hunt, these pups can be spunky and may see a child's antics as a threat. Number 10. Chihuahua When talking about lazy dog breeds, it's worth mentioning the Chihuahua, which is most content at just hanging around with its people. It's not that the Chihuahua is lazy, which is to say disinterested in activity. It's just that the Chihuahua is so tiny, it would take at least 10 steps to match each one of ours. So, high energy or low energy, the Chihuahua is likely to get tired of walking long before its people do. And that makes the Chihuahua exceptionally low maintenance, if not truly lazy. Number 11, Maltese. Maltese are a great social lap dog. They are ideal for apartment dwellers and have very minimal exercise needs. If you're looking for lazy dog breeds that would be ideal for urban households, and also some of the most beautiful small dogs around, the Maltese may be right for you. This breed is one of the very mild-tempered dogs. It does well with training based on positive reinforcement, but needs to be socialized at a young age to ensure that they are not nippy to strangers or other animals. Number 12. French Bulldog The French Bulldog is another brachycephalic dog, which makes a short walk around the block a big workout for them. They are single-owner dogs, perfect for people who live in apartments and the elderly. These adorable pups are very adaptable, and with the right French Bulldog food and exercise, they're also healthy. They are also intelligent, making them a wonderful choice for pet owners who wish to travel with their canine companions. Number 13. Shih Tzu This Chinese dog breed was developed by Tibetan monks as a gift from members of Chinese royalty. Their purpose was to adorn the laps of said members of royalty. When not napping, Shih Tzus tend to spend their time seeking out cuddles, pets, scritch scratches, and tickles. So, just how little exercise does a Shih Tzu desire or need? According to veterinarian, this low-energy dog will probably be happy simply wandering around the house and going outside for the occasional bathroom break. Number 14. Pug The pug is a great family dog that gets along with strangers and other animals. Their small size makes them perfect for apartment and city living, and low cost for pugs eat little food. The poster's child of brachycephalic dogs only need short walks around the block. Although they are charming and loving, the pug can also be quite mischievous. They'll keep you laughing, but aren't the ideal breed for pet owners who spend a lot of time away from home. Number 15. Bolognese. Also known as the Bichon Bolognese, this breed is very similar to the Bichon Frise. They are an affectionate dog that is ideal for apartment living because they are chill, prefer to lay around a lot, and make great lap pals. This lazy breed is eager to please and do well in obedience training. They only need a few short walks and some playtime to make sure their brain and body stay healthy. Number 16. Tibetan Terrier These well-natured dogs are suited for any living situation. The Tibetan Terrier picks up obedience training easily and enjoys the company of calm people and animals. They are very wary of their surroundings and will let out a warning bark. This is because they were bred to guard Tibetan monasteries. The Tibetan Terrier needs brisk walks a couple of times a day. Number 17. Greyhound It might surprise you to know that one of the very fastest dogs of all the breeds, the Greyhound, is quite lazy off the track. Timid and mild, these dogs are extremely calm and low maintenance. Their slender bodies lend great speed, built for agility and quickness. They are known for their short bursts of energy, but they don't maintain it. These traits make them excellent for going out and strenuously running, followed by a warm, relaxed evening at home. Because of a greyhound's racing history, there are many shelters devoted strictly to this breed. After they retire, they typically are surrendered to find their forever homes. Chances are there's plenty of these sweethearts looking for a place to rest their head. Number 18. Lhasa Apso 
Even-tempered and friendly, many people think this breed is a good choice for families. However, Lhasa Apsos do not do well with small children or strangers, and can be nippy. They are small and only need two or three walks a day, making them perfect for apartment living. Early training is essential with this breed, or your pup may develop some naughty behaviors in the future. Number 19. Brussels Griffon Lazy dog breeds, the Brussels Griffon is an intelligent dog, and they make loving lap dogs. They enjoy short, slow walks and cuddling with their owners. Early training and socializing are key with this breed because they bark excessively and can be timid with new people and animals. Alert and curious, these pups can also get themselves into trouble quickly when not supervised. Number 20. Bernese Mountain Dog One of four Swiss Mountain Dogs, the Bernese Mountain Dog is a sweet, family-oriented breed. This dog is an excellent stand-in for a stuffed animal and will cuddle with you all day despite its large size. They only need a few long walks a day. Calm and good-natured, this is another of the lazy dog breeds ideal for families with younger children. Number 21. Coton de Toulier. This dog will get along with almost everyone. They are very loving and sweet. Obedience training is a breeze with the Coton de Toulier. They adapt to the lives of their owners, which makes them great for city living and owners with busy schedules. This breed needs to be taken out on a couple of long walks every day, but they will be happy to cuddle up with you on the couch in between the walks. These dogs are brilliant, and their happy-go-lucky personality will keep you smiling. Number 22. Chinese Crested Lazy dog breeds the Chinese Crested will certainly attract attention wherever it goes. Their odd looks make them very popular. They are kind and great for first-time owners. This breed will also do very well in apartment life. Chinese Cresteds only need a few short walks a day with some indoor playtime. The hairless variety needs sunscreen when outdoors because they will get sunburn. Number 23, Newfoundland. The big fluffy bear-like Newfoundland is the prime definition of a gentle giant. These dogs thrive on human companionship and tend to be extraordinarily easygoing and good-natured. They are ideal choices if you're looking to raise a family. These dogs are generally extremely good with children, even showing very protective instinct, sometimes to keep them safe. Because the Newfoundland is so extraordinary furry and drooly, they might not be everyone's cup of tea for an indoor companion. Number 24, Pembroke Welsh Corgi. The dog breed was chosen by Queen Elizabeth herself. The Pembroke Welsh Corgi is very smart and easy to train. They are great with children, but may need some early training to stop nipping. Corgis get along with other animals, especially cats. The only exercise these guys need is a couple of short walks a day, but they require an appropriate corgi dog food diet. This breed is also very affectionate and will enjoy time spent snuggling on the couch with its owner. Number 25, St. Bernard. St. Bernard is a great watchdog that will lounge around the house all day. They need to be socialized and trained early to prevent disobedience that can be dangerous. Their size and bark will deter any unwanted guests. St. Bernard is a heavy drooler, so this breed is not ideal for a pristine home. It is often tough to get this breed to exercise, making our list of lazy dog breeds. Motivating your St. Bernard to get up and exercise is imperative to his overall health and well-being. Number 26, Irish Wolfhound. This ancient breed shows up all across history, displayed in art, poetry, and culture. This sighthound is one of the tallest dog breeds, but also one of the slower paced. These dogs are quite happy meandering around, no major impulsiveness or hyperactivity. Wolfhounds have a sound reputation for being very patient. They don't get worked up quickly over a rap at the door, but they can defend their home if needed. Number 27, Sharpe. Another dog hailing from China on the list is the classic Sharpay. Sharpays are instantly recognizable for their incredible wrinkles from head to toe. Even though this trait is cute, you have to clean their wrinkles daily to avoid infection in the folds of the skin. These dogs tend to be pretty particular about who they get close with. They bond very well with families, but tend to be aloof and even aggressive with strangers. If you want a guard dog that takes a calm approach to life, these dogs should be on your list of potential breeds. If you're on their good side, they make fantastic nap buddies. They will cuddle up to you any time of day to chill out on the couch. Number 28, 
Great Pyrenees. The Great Pyrenees is practically a mother hen. The entire purpose of the breed was to create a protective dog to guard livestock. These dogs meander around ensuring all is well, making them incredible for smaller children and barnyard animals. These dogs are similar to nannies, always looking out for everyone at home. Natural caretaker instincts run strong. They mosey around, taking time to stop and smell the roses, so to speak. Because of their intensely thick coat and ancient roots, these dogs tend to fare better in homes where they can explore the great outdoors. Number 29, Spinoni Italiano. The Spinoni Italiano is an old Italian hunting breed. Their lazy looks don't fool you. They truly love to catch catnaps any time of day or night. But they also thrive on exercise, so don't think you can skip walks with this breed. The Spinoni truly loves people. They are compatible with strangers and children the same. They are immensely sweet-spirited, adopting the lover-not-fighter mentality. Spinonis are very attention-oriented, so they don't fare well when they're alone long. Make sure you're willing to devote lots of time to this breed, ensuring they will be the best companions. Number 30. Clummer Spaniel the Clover Spaniel is an amiable breed that is calm and humble. They love hanging out with their humans, laying at your feet wherever you go. They meander along, having a very slow-paced approach to life. These dogs are very loyal, listening to your commands and reading your body language. Even though they are super calm, they do love to play. 